Hello people, this is Monzo Senior back here in our M of Summer Traditions, and today we are about to see how my toast tastes. I know that sounds odd, but that's what the last thing I did was on Songs of Aria. Okay, so, that's okay, I'll just take a mud, mudlidgen, mudlidgen, what? I don't, it already, first sentence, and I already ran into a word I don't even know. We don't waste food, Pre precious gifts from Aria in this house. We've got more than enough in in the pantry, though. You wouldn't miss it. You're gonna eat that toast as punishment for stealing my breakfast and then insulting it. Well, I would too. It's sausage. I don't really like sausage. <laughs> this was your doing, wasn't it? Naturally. Now get now get to it. Sir. So she burnt my toast. Okay. I glare at. Yeah, her for a few seconds until I realized that I'm not going to get out of this. I regularly raise the brute bread to my mouth and hiss as it floats before my face. Hesitate, hesitate as it floats before my face. Face. There isn't going to be an easy way to do this. Take small bites will only prolong the torture. Might as well get this over with as fast as possible. Maybe. Maybe I won't even have enough time to taste it. Crunch. Um. Um. I actually need that down there. What's on there? Okay, it's, it's nothing. It's nothing y'all can't read. Never mind. I don't have to blur that. God, <laughs> I have some things on here I can't exactly have out because they're spoilers. <laughs> I have never tried it before. I have never tried it before, but I imagine that it's um that it that it that is what ash tastes like, <laughs> and it doesn't taste good. I have a um, huge chunk. Um, ugh. I take a huge chunk of. Of the piece I'm eating, and as soon as I begin to chew, the whole thing dis disintegrates into dust and covers my entire mouth. I never, I narrowly, narrowly. It's supposed to be nearly. Oh, narrowly avoid choke. It should still be a nearly avoid choking, not narrowly. Is never. Would that be proper? Would it? Oh. And coughing as I. As I try to down it, my teeth and tongue are probably stained black, but it but it is better than the than that sausage. How bad could that sausage have been? I understand pig sausage, cause that stuff is pretty bad. But come on, it's deer sausage though. That's it. Stuff's okay. Still not a fan of sausage. I just don't like sausage. I, I love deer. I love pig. Just not sausage. <laughs> Now, what should should you do first? How about the laundry? Don't know how. Absolutely useless. Can't you just use your magic to do it? Why why do you even need a servant anyway if you can do it all with magic without even breaking a sweat? You don't you don't get it at all. First and foremost, we had a deal. If you can't live up to your end of the deal bargain, then I won't either. That doesn't explain why you'd want a servant in the first place. She doesn't want a servant, she wants a sex slave. Or that's my theory. What else was I going to ask you for? You don't have anything, and, apparent, and apparently you can't do anything either. Well, that kind of makes sense. Besides, when you do things with magic, it it lacks human... This... 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 I don't even what delicateness. I think is what that's trying to say. I don't even think that would be a proper word. Exactly what what you expect from a if a robot did it. Oh yeah, it's delicateness. Robot. Or what am I trying to say? Is is just because it's it's easier doesn't mean it's better. The that human touch is important. Whatever you say. Whatever you say, you know. Yeah. Just whatever. <laughs> I should not realize this. 
You just randomly doing that gay act like that. Reminds me of something Sam told me. Whatever. But if, if I knew magic, I'd never do my chores by hand. No cooking, no laundry. What can I get you to do? Think, think, think. She stands there thinking thinking and thinking of a good torture er, chore for me to do. A torture is a little bit more appropriate, I do believe, kind of. Probably not, actually. Please be something easy. Please something easy. Please be something easy. Why you repeat it so many times? My wish is cut down in an instant. The evil sneer has returned. Oh, the, the sneer that will haunt, me, haunt my dreams for eternity. And it really doesn't help that I'll be spending eternity here. I just got, I got just a job. Is it painful? No, no, nothing too bad. Sure. Just clean up the house a bit. That's... This is a mansion. There's no such thing as just cleaning up the house a, a bit. Aren't you a sharp one? Here, you can start with this. A closet in uh, in the hallway swings open by itself, and a, farth and a feather duster flies right at me. It hovers before my face for a second before landing to... Landing two light tip taps, light taps to the top of my head. Oh, okay. I grab it hurriedly, trying to prevent any more attacks. I pull hard, e expecting to feel a tug as though it was bound by invisibility, invisible strings. But as soon as my hand reaches the duster, it falls e easily and in and if effortlessly into my hand. Dust everything in the house. Once you're done with that, then you can mop the kitchen floor, vacuum the carpets, sweep up the hallways, clean the windows, scrub the walls, and polish the... What? The banisters? Oh my god, woman. Oh my... I know I'm OCD and I have to have my stuff organized and somewhat clean. I mean, I wouldn't say my room's actually clean, but it's it's organized in a manner to where it seems clean, even even though it's like lots of red specks on my floor. But that's for my cover; can't avoid that. Um, mainly my room just gets dusty. That's about it. But this is just nerving, nerve wracking. I mean, why don't you do this when it actually needs it, or why do you care? Like, I don't dust my room very often, but. Sweeping the floors would be something I'd have to do. Mopping every now and then, I could understand that. Vacuuming, definitely. I want to vacuum this room again. I vacuumed it last week, but that was to get all the red dots off the floor and they're all back. And polishing, I could care less. Kinda. Don't know how. Wow. Oh, no. That's not gonna work this time. I don't care about the quality of the job. I just want it done. Now get to it. Yeah, don't know how it doesn't always work. Might as well just say, yes sir, ma'am, sir. Whoops. Could you maybe... No, that's not gonna work this time. I don't care. Okay, no, I didn't read that. Okay. The whole mansion... The whole mansion... That'll... It... Ugh. It will take me hours just to do just to do the testing. Before today, if someone told me this was the price for a mentality, I would have said I'd gladly pay that. Right now, I'm ju I just want to cry. <laughs> Who's in the other room? Who's awake? It's only eleven. Brush, brush, brush. I swing the dust the dust brush warily over over pieces. Over piece after piece of furniture. What an awful job. That wouldn't be that hard to tell the truth. I'll probably be coughing coughing for the rest of the week once this is done. We act well, actually it doesn't really look that dirty to me at all. I think there's I'm I don't think there's any dust on anything. Is Melissa some kind of neat freak? If that's the case, I'm even more and I'm 
in even more trouble. I could have already told you she's a neat freak. You could look at the place and tell that. Just from the pictures. That's how good they are. I could look at this and tell you that they're clean. Okay. And just because well, of how much design and like architecture and just how homey this place is. Like, really? Kind of speaks out. Hey, I'm a neat freak. Or, hey, I like stuff being clean. You can always tell. Even though my room looks small and all that. It's actually a good size. <laughs> and so is my house. My house is humongous. She better not ask me to do this every day. Oh, yeah, she will. Hold on. Everything looks decently clean. I... I could just wonder about the mansion pretending to clean. I c couldn't tell the difference, and neither can she. He 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 he. You're a genius, Jason. A snail. A snail may. Wait, a snail may. A sn what? A snail my way. No, I snail my way. Not a. It's I snail my way. From, the, from room to room, doing nothing. Doing. Ugh. Not doing any dusting, ha! Huh. This is what you get trying to put me to work. After an after a half hour or so at a turtle's pace, I find myself in the same room I I woke up in this morning. I'm I'm running out of rooms to bide my time in. Why not take a little nap? The more time I kill, the harder she'll think I think I worked. Hmm, but this plan is a little risky. If Melissa walked in while I was sleeping, I could just imagine what would happen. Blah, 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 blah. Rip your arms off. Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> Something like that. I, I could just, I could just lock the door. Then it doesn't, it, then, then it doesn't look like I can, can be, it can, it can be opened from the outside at all. It should be safe. What about our magic, though? I shut the door, throw the latch, and then curl into then curl no, crawl into the bed. I'll get up in about an hour or two and deal with those other chores later. Good night. <laughs> Ooh boy. Hee <laughs> hee hee. What? Suddenly, a violent, suddenly and violently, I'm thrown from the bed, but I don't cr crash against the wall or the floor. Rather, I'm suspended upside down in midair. That would explain why everything just actually hurts my eyes to look at. Actually, I, I think my eyes are just hurting from the screen yet again. The UV rays off of everything that's flat screen like this. I hate them. I have to the old TVs that had the lines going like this the whole time. I mean, I was playing my Nintendo 64 earlier, and I could see the lines going like that. I'm like, oh my god, this is so beautiful. Because back in the day, that was that was the greatest graphics ever back in the day. That's, that's what I remember. I don't remember stuff like this. This is amazing, but that's just the nostalgia all all day long. I'm sorry I could play those all day long. <laughs> It feels like I'm being held up by by my right ankle by some invisible um, rope. <sighs> I look up at at the ground and find Melissa standing there with her amused evil smirk. I'm surprised she didn't climb in bed with you. I'm sorry. Did I wake you? Yes, and quite rudely too. Oh my! How how uncivil of me. I must apologize. I'm usually not this ill-mannered. Yeah, I believe that. You must you, you must have been working hard. Wore yourself out so much you collapsed, huh? Well, it is tough work. You seem so busy, so I hate to ask this of you, but while you're up there up there mining wait, mind giving giving the light and candles a good dusting too. I'm sure they could use it. I can't even move. Ah, thank you so much. I didn't say I'd do it. Thank you. Thank you. I I can let... I think you could let me down now. The blood is rushing to my head. Um, it wouldn't matter. It's the sound it made. No, well, that's the closest to the sound that... Actually, no. 
I, I don't have anything that makes a good ground hitting sound. My ground doesn't even do that. See? It sounds like carpet. <sighs> Maybe I should have asked that. Maybe I shouldn't have asked that. I pulled myself up off the floor. That was kind of rough. Hmm, you'll recover. Man, I can't even take a break. A break from what? You didn't dust at all. Hmm, find, found out, huh? I didn't need need to. I could guess it was something you'd do. Am I that obvious? Yes, painfully. Wow. You're already wasting enough... You've already wasted enough time to get... You've already wasted enough time to get started on the windows. Sure, sure, I'm on it. No, you're not. Ha, huh, I... Ha, huh, I'm beat. Ha, huh, I'm beat. How many do I have, have have I done so far? Two. It should be illegal to own a house this big. Stop complaining and get to work. Windows done. Out of breath? <sighs> I can fix that. I'll give you... I'll give you so much air, your lungs will explode. Um, I'm fine. I'm fine. What's next? Um, uh, what? Okay, I'm trying to figure out—is she saying CPR kiss, or is she just gonna throw him into the air? I don't know. Good. You can vacuum the carpets now. V vacuum? To answer my question, she has a straight well willed. Wait, a straight wheeled bag walk, walk itself over towards us. What is this? It's a vacuum. Don't tell me you've never heard heard of one before. Afraid not. But you knew how to use the toaster. Of course, who doesn't? I'm never going to answer that. <laughs> I, I don't know how to use the toaster. Actually, I do. I, I use them all the time. Or I used to. Don't worry. I, when was the last time I used a toaster? God. Should ask my girlfriend to see how often they use toasters if they even have a toaster. I don't think they do. I think they do, but I don't know. Oh well. See, Hyundai sure doesn't leave, leave you guys many luxuries. What other technologies is he hiding from you? To take knowledge? What? M machines, appliances, electronics, what? whatever else. You at least know about electricity, right? Of course I do. Well, what do you use it for? The toaster, the oven, the refrigerator. Is that it? Where's the microwave? You need a microwave. What do I even use? Uh, let's see, what do I use microwaves for? Hot pockets, corn dogs, pizza bites. Don't use for hot chocolate not anymore. Have a little maker for that. It makes it real nice. Nice and hot too. It always burns me. I don't ever actually use a microwave. Hmm. Except maybe the warm-up sandwich. Cheese sandwich. Cheese and turkey, let me get that right. If there's no turkey, I grill. I put it on a pan and make a grilled cheese with the pan. Cause that's what we do here in southern Louisiana. I don't know about y'all northern people or Canadian folk. <laughs> huh. Hmm. So he cuts you a few breaks when food is concerned, but but it's the hard way for everything else. Interesting. So what does this thing do? It sucks up dirt from from the ground. Okay, one, you're wrong. It doesn't suck. It blows. Science never sucks, people. It blows. My chemistry teacher was explaining this to us the other day. It, science never sucks. It always blows. It only blows. Correction. Now, how, how, how it does for a vacuum, I have no idea, but it blows. Not sucks. It blows. <laughs> that's, that's it. Pretty much. It's rather simple. Nothing magnificent about it except of except of course that this one runs off off magic the normal ones run off electricity like your appliance at home oh, okay all right then pay close attention take notes if you have to 
she quickly runs through the motions of proper vacu vacuum operation operation then leaves it to me have i have to say for my first time at it i don't think i did poorly at all it didn't ugh, it didn't break or anything okay well i'm gonna stop here middle of the chores we'll get to mopping next what it says mopping and sweeping and scrubbing is this this story has just been more of he wouldn't even get to do chores. I think that's what all this episode was about, besides toast. No. Cut it. Nope. I did start off with the toast on this one. But until then, it's felt up as I'm saying. See you next time. Next time we'll see about the mopping, sweeping, and scrubbing of stuff. But until then, signing out. Do this right.